Hello everyone. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Elite Surfs. The best unit that we've ever gotten, quite frankly. I was actually so hyped um, for this unit. Uh, I'm still so hyped, man. I've been having a blast using them. Um, yeah, I'm just going to show you their mastery. Oh, so It's so good. Alright, jokes aside, this mastery is questionable. But what it does, it heals you. Heals allies for 300 health per second for five seconds, so it's all right. Um, kind of mid. It gives that means your ally will basically tank an extra hit. Uh, but this is actually not bad, not bad at all. This is the real thing that people actually care about. Now, if you're facing Zakalian militia, the coconut throwers, or the Syphos, or Rad Marksman, or any other poison thing, or anything else that inflicts burn this can be very helpful now I know no one likes this unit or, or they don't like that I got a mastery and that I do agree with that they could have mastered literally any other unit except the gray ones and I would personally be fine but it's alright to be honest with you I got them decked out with the best doctrines I could put on them iron size 5 just because I thought it would be really funny. Uh, I'm throwing. I didn't know what to put here. Uh, I could put piercing defense actually. Never mind. No, nope, the health one is fine. Um, yeah, they got iron sides. And yeah, they got their block thing. So basically, some tips and things you should know is that I'm going top line for charge damage. I, I did this before the. Uh, mastery so it's just gonna be like this because I'm not resetting their veterancy it does not matter in all honesty maybe a middle line maybe middle line maybe middle line will be pretty good but I don't really know hmm all right oh yeah the tip is that even if there's like one unit remaining it'll still have the same effect all right you'll see that in some of these clips and another thing, if you're playing longsword, which for most of this clip or most of these clips I was, you'll see that the numbers, the healing numbers, will not show. It'll it will only show when you um, do your mercy of heaven. So yeah, that's about it. That's all I want to say. Let's get right into the clips. Okay, everyone. So we're in the clips here. So this is. The, all these clips are in casual matches. Uh, don't use these guys for half the match in rank. Or in general, you, you'd be better off using any other unit. But right now, I'm trying to showcase the unit and their healing abilities. Trying to figure out if they're actually like a decent support unit. Now, you can't see the healing ticks, but you can see the longsword healing ticks. So I guess you only can have one or the other. Because I was playing Glaive and I could see the healing ticks. So, if you didn't know, there's a longsword rune that gives that gives 10% defenses when you use Mercy of Heaven. So I'm always just trying to put that on my allies. Uh, I'm also using the Surf healing as well to really heal up the team. I don't know how much impact we had there. There's a lot of buffs though. Right here. Okay, it looks like we're gonna charge the woodcutter with our four surfs. Okay. A little heal. Um, another thing. It will not like the your allies won't turn green unless they actually are damaged. So if you're if you press two on a bunch of max health people, it won't do anything, or it won't visually change. So that's how you know how much you're doing. So if everything you press to and everything turns green, you're actually healing a lot of stuff. But keep in mind, it's not a lot, I'm not gonna lie. It's like 1,500 in total. That's not a lot, yeah. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. This is kind of, it's kind of a niche unit. I've, I've barely had any situations where the surfs actually like were game changer because 
when you're pushing Rad and Marksman, these guys die so fast, it's insane. And same with Zakalian Militia or the Flamethrower guys. They just will not hold up. But on a positive note, their healing radius is quite large, so maybe you can make a play with that, like heal around the corner or something. But here we're going, we're supporting the team. We got an Imperial Pike Guard stack here. Men at Arms are coming in. We're trying to support here. Um, we're giving the defense buff. All right. Heal's about to come off cooldown. We're about to throw another one. Fortunately, there's just too much, and it overwhelms us. But it was a decent showing. That's about an average game if you're going to use the Serfs. So, yeah. Alright, on this second clip here, we only have a single surf. Alright, I just wanted to show um, that even though you have four or one surf, it'll still impact you the very same. Alright, it'll. Yeah, it doesn't matter. But like I was saying earlier, everything turns green if they're actually damaged. Here, look at that. I press two, everything turns green. I'm grabbing them juicy support points. Um, I remember in this match, my allies were quite mad at me for using surfs, and it was casual, so I figured that'd be okay, but unfortunately, my team didn't think so. It's alright. We are trying to support the team. We're playing a pretty boring role, I'm not gonna lie. So as we can see, we're healing a bunch of stuff. A lot of stuff is getting ticked. I think we might have healed it to full. Maybe. Yeah, I'm not seeing any more ticks from my longsword. Mercy of Heaven. So, that right, that right there, that was pretty good. Since, at the beginning of this clip, a Shenji bomb just, like, dropped on our entire push. That's another unit I'm thinking about reviewing. The Shenjis. But right here, we only have a single surf. And we're just... Hitting that, <laughs> we're just hitting the ability <laughs> over and over. Again, do not do this. Um, yeah, so we're, it looks pretty good. We are winning. I have like zero kills, by the way, this entire game. That's probably why they're mad, and rightfully so. Uh, but look at that heal. Everything just turned green right there. We got a bunch of support points from that. Uh, yeah, in rank, just, if you're using this in rank, just use the push towers or when you have no other unit. So, yeah, it's, definitely I'd rather take these than, would I rather take these than Marcello Tori? I don't know. So, Serps. I think it's a waste of a mastery. If you want my actual opinion or overall opinion, they should have mastered anything else. I think they just took the lazy route, to be honest. It was probably just the easiest thing to uh, implement. I mean, is, the mastery is barely doing anything except like AoE heal and remove bleeding and burning, which no one cares. But something you should know is that. Compared to Martellatory, these guys, I'd still rather take Martellatory, but for free-to-play players or people who don't have Martellatory, just take these. These guys are actually not bad, or you could take Village Watchmen. They're also a good option. So, as a peasant unit, they're alright. Um, so, that's basically my entire review of the serfs. Uh, don't use them. To do anything but push towers or if it's your last unit so that's all uh thank you guys for watching and peace out